hope you are all well. I can give it a few moments for me to log on. Half. Twelfth of April. Good luck to those heading back to work. Let's things slowly start to lift, fingers crossed. We stay going in the right direction. Good morning, good morning. Happy Monday. I hope you are all well on this snowy, cold Monday morning. <laughs> do, do, do. Just give it a few moments, let people log on. It's very crazy. This time last year, good morning Jim. This time last year I've been jog doing yoga in the garden, bright sunshine, blue skies, 23 degrees. Today I have walked up the garden and it was snowing. <laughs> so, crazy, crazy weather. Good morning. Um, there may there may be burpees for it. You, I don't know. I don't know. I'm at now 1,100 for the challenge, so you know I might chuck a couple in this workout to help me up my numbers a little bit more. You never know. But I'll just give it a few more seconds. So if this is the first time joining, I'm joining. Welcome to the workouts. I've been doing these for over a year now. It's absolutely crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Why can't you try to say about my burpees, guys? You love them. You love them. Anyway, um, for everybody, a reminder to make sure you've got a nice, clear space to work out in. Nothing to fall over. No children, no partners, no pets, no furniture. Just make sure it's nice and clear. Um, have a door or window open for ventilation because you will get warm. Obviously, not as warm as this time last year. Uh, water, and very important to stay hydrated. And a towel or a mat. Uh, specifically for the stretches and that at the end, but also for any floor work that we do as part of the workout. Please work to your own fitness levels. I know. Um, so you know what they are. Morning, John. I can't see you, so I can't correct you. So please, please, I do try and give alternatives if necessary. And I might potentially be doing the, the less intense alternatives at the moment with a... <laughs> 1,100 burpees to my name in the last 12, 11 days. I'm a little, little bit achy, just a little bit. But this workout will help ease everything back out. So, without further ado, we'll start with the warm up. The whole thing is about 40 minutes in total, including the warm up, pull down, and stretch. And the main section of the workout is 20 minutes. So, let me get my timer going. So, we're just going to step from side to side and bring the arms across the body. Waking everything up. <sighs> Stretching everything out. So weirdly, my legs and arms are alright. It's my ribs that are killing me at the moment. At the beginning it was my lats, and now it's my ribs. <laughs> I think it's the jump up in the air more than the jump out. But there we go. It's all good for me. It's all good for me. And I do take the odd rest down, so don't worry. Keep going. And up rest and bring arms up. Above the head. Yeah, on Saturday I, I only did 20 burpees on Saturday. Did 80 yesterday, 20 the day before. Previous days have all been sort of 100, 150. So keep going, so go from side to side. Nice straight arms. If you can't bring them that high, just bring them out to shoulder height. Depends what your range of motion is and if you've had any injuries, just please be careful. If this is your first time getting into exercise or your first time for a long time, please. Potentially, please speak to your GP first, just make sure it is okay. So drop your shoulders from ears, feet, shoulder width, arms out, and opening up the chest. That's it. Ooh. Ah. I think I'm going to have to see a sports therapist after all of those burpees. <laughs> a good, good sports massage. A few more seconds. I have been doing yoga every evening. So stretch back out. A few more seconds. Keep those shoulders down from the ears. This is a good one if you spend a lot of time hunched over a desk. Keep the nice feet shoulder width. Try and keep them nice and straight. You're going to twist, walk down the outside of your leg. If you feel your knees start to bend, that's where you need to stop. You can walk across in the air. If you can touch the floor, walk across the floor. And then back up the other side. Walk down wherever you can to keep your legs straight. Nice stretch through the back of the legs. Pull across nice and slowly and come back up. All the stretches that we're doing at the beginning, and I've done 
dynamic in that we are constantly moving. We don't hold any of the stretches, they're not static stretches. And then at rest, come up and into a gentle jog. If you don't want to jog, you can march it through, get the knee nice and high. If you want to take the impact out, if you've got any problems, any problems, coming from injury, or you're trying to be nice to neighbours downstairs, whatever works for you. Keep going. Few more seconds. Last few. And with that rest, we're going to open up the hips now. So facing forward, hip up and out to the side and back in. So hip openers or opening the gate or the thing you see the footballers do at side the pitch. With any of these movements, you might hear some or feel some clicks and cracks and pops. As long as it's not painful, it's quite normal. If it is painful, reduce your range of motion. And if it continues to be painful, please refrain from doing that movement. Try it again. If it continues to be painful, please speak to a health professional. I know, easier said than done. Next, we're going to do heel flicks or butt kickers. So just bringing those heels up behind you. Again, you can set this one through if you need to. Few more seconds. Let's bounce from side to side. Last few. Keep breathing. Keep smiling. Just getting our heart rate up. And at rest, feet hip weight. We're going to step out into a lunge. So 90 degrees in both knees, and then we're going to take over that front leg. And push back. Tight. Push back. So come out. Drop down. So your knees in line with your torso. Tight. Push back. Few more seconds. Last few. Last one. Next, we're going to do a squat. So you Feet, shoulder weights, feet slowly turned out. Knees are going to follow the toes. Flick the bum back, sit back, and then come up. Nice stretch. Doesn't have to be a deep squat. We are just warming up. Just push back a little bit, come up. Squat down, and push up. A few more seconds. Almost there. We'll just do 30 seconds of jumping jacks and then we're ready to go into the main workout. So, 30 seconds of jumping jacks. Again, you can step the jumps from side to side. If you're jumping, take the knees out, knees back in. Feet 
Shoulder width, toes slightly out, and we're going to come down. One, two, three, four. Come up, nice squeeze at the top. Down on one, two, three, four, and squeeze at the top. Then you'll, you'll be really surprised. There's some burpees. So I can get some burpees in towards my total. So again, you can do an incline burpee. So if you've got a sofa, you can have your hands on the sofa and you can step it out. Or you can jump it out. You can take the jump out at the end and just raise up. You've just got to make the burpee work for you. You can even step it out on the floor. One out, one out, one in, one in. And then stretch up. Or if you're here, the basic one that I do, hands down, jump out, jump in, and jump up. Down, out, in, and up. Then we are on the mat for a superhero. So knees are in line with hips, wrists are under the shoulders. And we're going to slide out, we're going to come up. And we're going to just pulse one, two, three, four, and slide it back in. Slide the other one out and pulse one, two, three, four, and back down. If you do find that really hard, initially you can try just sliding out and lifting up and coming back down, even if you don't lift up too high. And again, if that is too much, focus on just taking one leg out, one leg out, one arm, and then one arm. And rotate like that and just make it work for you and then the last exercise we've got one two three four five six and then we're up for one two four five six so six mountain climbers six high knees and again with the mountain climbers you can always do them from an incline or you can step them so make the workout work for you i will be going a bit slower today Everything aches. <laughs> but hopefully this will help me loosen everything up. So if you are ready, now's the time to put some music on if you want it. And we will start with the jab cross. Front, back knee, front knee, kick, switch feet. Let's see if I can actually remember it. So first 50 seconds. Off we go. So jab. Cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, switch feet. There we go. Jab, cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, switch feet. So it's a good coordination one. Jab, cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, switch feet. Jab, cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, switch those feet. If you can't keep too high, don't worry. Jab, cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, switch feet. Jab, cross, jab, cross, back knee, front knee, kick, I nearly forgot. Switch feet and then get ready for the squat. Got 10 seconds. Got 10 seconds. So the first one, get one off the brain. Get ready, we're gonna squat down to the count of four. So we go one, two, three, four, and then come back up, squeeze the glutes at the top. One, two, three, four, squeeze at the top. Two, three, four, and come up nice and controlled. Two, three, four, and back up. Come down, one, two, three, four, and squeeze at the top. So if you do have problems pushing back and you feel like you're leaning forward too much, so flick the hips first. You can always put a dining chair behind you so that your brain knows you've got something to aim for. Four, and come back up. One, two, three, four. Squeeze back up. Five One, seconds. two, three, four. Squeeze back up. And Next rest. Next we have buckies. At least I've got two in for the day so far. Just take it easy. Off you go. So hands down as you're jumping out. In and up. Down, out, in and up. Keep going. Keep 
One, two, three, four, and slide back down. Slide out. Up. One, Halfway there. Three, four, slide, and back down. Halfway there. 
almost then. So one, two, four. That's in. Slide out. Up. One. Fourteen, fourteen, plus two. So, well, well done, guys. Catch your breath. Have a drink of water. Don't run off. We're going to do some stretches now. Very important. So, we're going to come down to the mat. And bring. And knees into our chest. <sighs> and breathe. And I'm going to start the timer. <sighs> Just come down when you're ready. <clears throat> Don't come down too soon. I want you feeling like headed. Days you don't, and I definitely hurt more on the days I don't do them. 
more seven. I'm sure none of the rest of you believe they become addictive. <laughs> Even more seconds. And then let that rest slowly come up onto all fours, swivel over. Knees in line with hips, wrists in line with shoulders. As you breathe in, raise your head up, drop the back down. And as you breathe out, push up through the shoulder blades, round the back. Deep breaths, a few more seconds. Last few. And let that rest slowly come up. Roll up through your shoulders. And we're going to come over to a wall, stretch out the back of the calf. Feet hit width apart, hold the foot to the wall. Everything else in line, and push up. What is that? Front leg standing up nice and tall. facing forward, engage the core. So I did 12 plus 12, 24, plus the 14 at the end. 24 plus 14, 38, plus the 2 would make 40. soft, pull up that foot, push the hips forward and pull that foot back. If anyone else can do it, it could be a room with my mats, concur. Because <laughs> normally my mats are pretty good, but after that I'm not sure it is. Switch side. Thank 
the night. Full body stretch. So stretch it up, lean down one side, stretch down, come back up, and lean to the other side. And up, lean to one side, and up. <laughs> Can you find more on your ribs? Asking for a friend. No? Okay. Didn't think so. I can't imagine it would be very comfortable. And come up, drop one arm between shoulder blades, chin up to the chest, head up. Oh. A few more seconds, so just tri stretching out the triceps. Thank you for those who stick around for the stretches. Trust me, it is totally worth it and so important. You need to have your stretches. A few more seconds. And switch sides. Is that right? I only need to do another 47 burpees today. That's not too bad. I can do that. Stretch out the shoulders. This is the last two stretches. Pulling the shoulder down from the ear, pulling the arm across the body. Switch sides. Last three seconds. Whew. Keep breathing. there, roll the shoulders back and forward. Ah, uh, thanks Jim. <laughs> it was a tough one, but I kind of enjoyed it. I, d I always panic when I see that I've done the 50 seconds, 10 seconds transition because you can't say that that's a rest. And then it always is quite a good one. So I hope you all have a good week as things are, fingers crossed, slowly opening back up. Good luck to those, anyone going back to work. Um, and I will still be here on Thursday, 8 a.m. Uh, for another workout, if you wish to join me. I have to admit, there might, there might be some burpees. You don't, I don't know, maybe, possibly. Thanks, Philip. Um, otherwise, you can use the replays. They're on the, uh, you, uh, let's try that again. They're on the Become Fit for Life page on Facebook, and they're also on the Decathlon UK Facebook page. And I've uploaded a good number of them now to YouTube, so if you want to get them there, Otherwise, have a uh, thank you. I agree, good way to start the week. Enjoy the rest of your week and I will see you Thursday.